Yeah, yeah that's like, right. Yeah, this was easy yeah. to fit it on. Cool. Well, there you know, I got a. I got oh, one, we'll free, show them, man. one for each wrist now. All right, second watch. Isaac Updike just ran 839 to win the pen relays. I would describe the conditions as not perfect. So, uh, no. Yeah, uh, by definition, this is Southeast Alaska. So that kind of had a home court advantage uh, there. So 839, you know, you ran a little bit faster earlier in the season, yeah. but what were you hoping to get out of today when it's 48 degrees, raining and windy? Uh, yeah, just pra practice tactical racing and uh you know really working on making a definitive move and almost training the last part of the like the hurdles which is really trying to get down and quick uh because if you can close in a six gear faster you're not making a team well you close in 60 today yeah is with one lap to go what do you feel like a little different than a normal steeple yeah yeah it felt kind of more like a workout um obviously that i ran 12 seconds faster a month ago so my fitness is uh not representative of the time, but pretty confident, I guess, going into the last lap that I had a gear to shift to. The thing is, I don't know what anyone else is like, right? They could all be feeling the same way. So when I make the move, I want to make sure that it was hard. And generally, I try to do that over the hurdle, so you can kind of catch the block guard a little bit. The steeple fit here at Penn has changed uh, than a few years ago, but I guess from a steepler's perspective, how is it set up here compared to some other tracks? Um, I would say the only big difference that I know of is the barriers are wrapped in like a Mondo. So it actually, it's, it's kind of slick right now with the rain. Um, and on the first water pit, I actually kind of landed a little too far back and slid a little bit uh, before getting my spikes into the top of it. How's everything been going though? You know, obviously, you know, win with today. Empire. You're with uh, Empire. Yeah, so. Uh, yeah, you know, what happened? What, what? Nothing, nothing happened. New uniform. Life happened. Uh, yeah, no, uh, my contract with Nike uh, ran its course. Um, currently in the process of looking for some other opportunities. Uh, but when that happens, uh, Sidious may be the first to know. Um, what's next? Are you going to go overseas and chase fast time or something before I'm, USA? I'm yeah, I, uh, I'll do the end of May. And then I, depending on how I race there and... Uh, contacts and all that stuff try to get into maybe a fast uh race in france uh for like three weeks before usa's does the steeple field feel kind of open this year at usa's i mean not in the sense that it's weak but in the sense that we there's know. six guys that have a very legitimate shot yeah maybe more. yeah i think the steeple is going to be one of those events again where even going in, if you don't have the standard, the top three guys are going to run sub 815. Um, unless it's like this. Uh, so, yeah, it's, it's, there's, I, I can think of six or seven other guys outside myself that I all I all look for on a given day in small places. Getting more like a 15. So, you want to cool down before you get. Uh... I'm already cool. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Congrats,